It's okay. Is everything all right? Yeah, it's handled. You barely touch the food. I don't have much of an appetite, but. Oh no, I'm I'm sorry. Maybe we should have done something else for our date. I mean, nothing would have fixed this. It's just. I'm not ready to date anyone right now. Oh. It truly really isn't you, it's me. I guess this is a waste of time for you, as much as it is for me. No. I would like to understand. Are you in love with someone? <laughs> well, I'm in love with my work, with my freedom. I'm only here because my parents threatened to give me the silent treatment if I don't let them set me up at least once. <clears throat> Figured it was a small enough sacrifice. Uh, so, I'm the sacrificial lamp, huh? <clears throat> Sorry. No, it's fine. I mean, we don't have to be each other's soulmates, but we can put the evening to a better use and try to be friends. If that's okay with you. Why not? All right. So, if you're solely focused on career right now, is having a family anywhere in your future or future plans? Well, it's less about when and more about meeting the ideal guy. Ouch. No offense to you. You seem like a nice guy. <laughs> As opposed to not being nice, why does it sound like it's a problem? Well, niceness in itself is not the problem. It only becomes problematic when it's all you have to offer. Enlighten me. Let's start with you. Describe your ideal woman. I don't have a list, if that's what you're asking. Just what kind of woman that appeals to you? Hmm, my kind of woman, my kind of woman. Well, she has to be kind, nice, small, good heart. <laughs> You're describing Mother Teresa. <laughs> I don't have specifics, but a woman who can support me and whom I can support is all I want. But that's it. I'll come once more and then we're done. Okay, no problem. Take care. One more thing. How come you guys don't have an Instagram page? Me, I don't use social media like that though. I don't have that kind of time. 
And me too. I don't have data for it. No, I don't mean for you personally. I meant for the business. Oh. Yeah. My madam didn't tell me anything like that though. Well, you need an online presence or else this business will never grow. No offense. Your target audience is online. You need to advertise online if you want them to come. That part is non-negotiable. <gasps> really? Mention it to Mrs. Essien today. Okay, no problem. Okay, for real. Bye. Bye. Instagram. I thought that place was only for posting of pictures though. In my community college, all the girls were using it to snap. Are you not with the office phone? Mm-hmm. Then download the app now. Right. You're kidding, right? Are you people really part of this generation? What? What is it? You want to insult us again because of social media? Even my mom uses Instagram. Seen that one. What kind of un un unwarranted attack was that? But what's on your list? I'm sure you have it written, complete and specific. <laughs> no. Heck yeah. I wrote this about a year ago after a bad breakup. What can help me cope? I take this everywhere with me. All right, let's hear it. <clears throat> My ideal guy. He must be handsome, be employed and great at his job. He must love dogs or animals in general. Adventurous yet strict and disciplined. Must know how to handle me Make me laugh too. Should be able to cook a meal or two. Handle you. What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I get emotional sometimes. Irrational, I admit, but who doesn't? <laughs> I guess I find it attractive when a man is able to nip that all in the bud and bring it back to my senses, you know? Hmm. What? Hmm. What do you think? What do you think about your ideal guy being vulnerable from time to time? He's allowed to feel, you know. Just non-necessary tears. It portrays a sort of incapability to me. Total opposite of what I want. Really? Yeah. Isn't it unethical to ask someone to bear your emotions while you're forbidding them from expressing theirs? I'm a working woman, Mark. I have goals. I can't be burdened by a lack of manliness. What a shocking turn of events. Hmm? A progressive woman like you turned out to be so shallow. But that is an understatement. How so? You can't go into a relationship without expecting to be emotionally available to your partner. I can't. Oh, I see what this is. What? This just proves what I said. Here you are making excuses for your nature. Am I? And what is my nature? Weak, essentially. Being in touch with my emotions doesn't make me weak. In fact, men who accept their vulnerability treat men better. Like I said, a nice guy is the last thing I need. I'm sorry if you don't need to leave, alright? Those were just my honest thoughts. You don't know anything about me. What I want and what I need. Have a good night. Is everything okay, sir? I 
Yep, everything is uh, so okay. Do you need anything? Just check now, please. Yeah. yeah. Clarita was bragging to me that her shop is popping, her sales are through the roof, and all that. She had the nerve to say sorry that she hasn't been to the restaurant. As if I need her business. <laughs> Until we need everyone's business. I hope this Bella's publicity will work. Don't worry, Mrs. Essien, it will work. It's not rocket science. Chef was showing off his amazing cooking skills on camera, and the footage looks wonderful, if I may say so myself. Surprise! Clarita, why are you here? Oh, please. I told you I'm so by to work. We'll be leaving now. Okay, dear. Bye. Bye. <sighs> so, I heard you hired cameras. Yes, they are working on something extremely special for the restaurant. Oh, well, I just wanted to stop by and uh, see how it's going. Thank you. But I guess you've got a handle on things. Mm. Sure. I'll see you for when it's this dinner, right? Yes. Good night then. Good night. Bye. She spent so many years in Europe only to come back and extend colonization with her oppressive personality. So, which, which dinner are you going for? Oh, that. I and my friends meet up once in a week to complain about our husbands and discuss about whose business is better. And Clarita is currently on the winning streak. Thank mm -hmm. you. 